Hey everyone, Doug from Convology. In this video, I'm going to show you how to take wishlist member and create a navigation menu where some items in that navigation only appear based on the membership level that the user has in wishlist member. So for example, here on my demo site, I want member dashboard to only appear when somebody is a logged in paid registered member and I want join the club to appear if they're not a member. Let's take a look at how to do that. So you want to add a plugin. This is a great plugin that's recommended by Wishlist Member and honestly a couple other membership platforms. It's called If Menu. So search for If Menu and believe it or not they don't show up at the top for that name but if you scroll down it's this one that you're looking for right here called If Menu Visibility Control for Menu Items. Now go to your Appearance menus, find the two navigation items that I was talking about or whatever you have and remember what I said I want member dashboard to only appear if they are logged in and a member so I want to enable visibility rules and then I need to save the menu and refresh the page or just save the menu that did it too. So now I want to show this item member dashboard if the user is a wish list membership level, and here's what's uh, what's a little bit annoying about this plugin, you have to save it again or refresh. If they are a, uh, so let's go back in here. If they're wish list membership level, gold or silver, right? So you can hold Control to select multiple levels. Not the greatest user interface, but this is the best plugin that I found for this. So I want it to appear if they are a gold level or a silver level and I want to save that and join the club should only be visible here we go again right gonna have to enable that refresh it only if the user is not logged in so we're going to hide if logged in okay save the menu there so that's all there is to it now whenever somebody is logged in as a member of these levels they will see member dashboard. If they are not logged in, they will not, if they are not logged in, all they'll see is join the club. Pretty simple. It's a great way for you to create a dynamic navigation that allows you to have things like your member dashboard or a call to action that you don't necessarily want somebody to see both of, right? Because it doesn't make too much sense to ask them to join if they're already a member. So if you have any questions about how to create a dynamic menu, Feel free to leave a comment in the video or click the link down in the description below and you'll be taken to my blog post on convology.com where I go into just as much detail, but it's written in case you want to read it instead of watch it. If you have any questions, let me know.